What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Um, if you're new to the channel, please like, subscribe, and uh, share the video. Um, this channel, my, my one of my focuses on this channel is helping helping up and coming musicians. Um, so I'm gonna do a series on if you're a beginner and you're trying to gig out, if you've never gigged out in public before and you're wanting to do that, I'm gonna do a whole series of that, put together some stuff and some resources to help. And um, yeah, so let's get to it. So for today, I'm just gonna do a quick video of one of my setups. There's different gigs I play. So this gig actually has a PA in the venue. So I'm gonna show you the things that I bring just to plug into it. It makes it a lot simpler because I don't have to bring speakers and that kind of stuff. Okay, I'm actually loading up to leave for this gig tonight. So the first thing, of course you're gonna need your instrument. I have a guitar here. This is a acoustic with an electric input. Um, so you definitely have an instrument. The next thing I have here is a small mixer. It's a couple channels. Um, this is where I'm gonna input my vocal on my guitar. And then I'm gonna output uh, into the PA system at the venue. I have various cables and stuff. Sorry, this is a mess. It's just, I'm a road dog. I've been playing thousands of gigs over the years. Um, so, but mixing board. Next up, a microphone stand, okay? And this one has a boom on it. So that way I could attach an iPad to it. And uh, so microphone stands. Some venues might have microphone stands, some don't. Some stands, some don't. So I always bring one just in case. This, uh, this particular venue though, I know they don't. So that's why I bring mine. Next item for gigging out is a microphone. This is a SM58 by Shure. I've had this for close to 20 years, man. And this thing is a beast. I put a little foam screen thing on it. Um, but yeah, so a microphone. Um, check out Shure SM58 or any microphones that are similar to them. They are amazing and roadworthy. This right here is my like gearbox full of everything and anything you can think of. So here's my iPad stand, I have a guitar stand, um, power strip, uh, tons of cable, backup cables. That's another thing too I'll get into. Always, always create backups because things are gonna fail for you. And if you're playing music for a client, you wanna make sure you have stuff that will back you up, that won't put you in a position where you're gonna be you know, without the tools you need. Next up is here's a bunch of pedals I use. You don't have to use any of this stuff, but I play with a looper because tonight's gig, it's a four hour gig, so I play four sets. Um, so when I loop everything, I'm able to put, you know, uh, uh, make beats on the guitar and stuff like that and make the sound fill up, um, play different parts on the guitar. This is a harmonizer, so it harmonizes my vocals. So it makes, it makes like a one man show sound like a little bit fuller. So, and this is all on a pedal board. So that way I can just set it up, plug in and go. I don't have to set up each pedal. Another thing, sorry for the mess, tons of bungee cords. Um, I carry a hand, hand truck, hand cart, put a bunch of pads on it so when I load speakers and stuff on it, I don't damage my speakers. Um, I'll get into all that stuff too in terms of gear. Um, I actually have a stool because I sit down and then I have some pads that I could sit on because I'm sitting for like 45 minutes at a time. Um, but that's pretty much the gist of it. So yeah, that's the pretty much, a, it's a small setup that I use when I go to venues that already have in-house systems that I could just plug directly into and uh, plug and play, they call it. So um, hope you enjoyed the video, hope this helps. Stay tuned, I got a bunch more stuff dropping that I want I want to be able to take all the things I've learned over the last 25, 30 years and share with up and coming musicians to help them so they won't run into any jams or anything like that. Or if they do run into a jam, then they'll know what to do. Um, but we're all loaded up and headed to this gig tonight. So thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, share the video, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.